Hello, in this video I want to talk about the important book by Harry Frankfurt called On Bullshit. It's a very short book, it's very readable, and you can probably read it in less than an hour, but the content is so important that I would recommend it and I would put it on a list of top 10 books for students, especially students in social science and psychology. I am going to incorporate this book in my new course on uh, self-awareness and social responsibility. So let me talk about a couple of things that Frankfurt does in this book that are very important. The first one is that he points out that every time you make an expression, when I inform you about something, I, I'm not just in relationship with one piece of fact. So for example, I'll, I'll say, that door is open. Just think about that sentence. But that door is open. What I'm expressing is, is not just the fact that the door is open, I'm not just referring to a state of affairs in the environment, I'm also expressing my state of mind. So every expression is attached to my state of mind, and I'm telling you that I believe that the door is open. So I'm also referring to my own, my own belief, something about myself. Of course, I'm referring to, I'm in a relationship to so many other things, like my relationship to the person who's understanding me, I'm assuming that the person can do something with this piece of information that is relevant to them. But let's just pay attention to this one, these two items. The uh, bit of environment, a piece of, uh, the fact about the environment and the fact about my state of mind. Frankfurt says that when we tell a truth or when we lie, we care about those things. We care about the state of mind and how it is going to be perceived by the other person. And we also care about what is true. Even a liar cares about what is true about the environment, what is true about the world. And because they care and because they think it is significant, they, they distort it to serve their own purpose. But a bullshitter, a person who is bullshitting, is unique in their emotion about the fact in the environment. Why? Because a bullshitter, according to Frankfurt, is indifferent to the truth. He doesn't love or hate the truth, he just doesn't care. So Frankfurt says that the truth can be accidentally told by a bullshitter, but it's still a bullshit because a bullshitter doesn't care about the truth. Remember those two items that we talked about, the fact about the environment and the fact about the mind and self? The bullshitter pays more attention and what is most important about the bullshitter is himself. How other people are going to agree with me or how other people are going to perceive me and respond to what I told them. It is a very self-centered relationship with expressions and communication. And it's much more about what I'm going to get from this. Something else that uh, he, Frankfurt says towards the end of the book is the conditions, social conditions and institutional conditions that promote bullshitting. He says uh, very importantly, he points out that every time people are promoted, people are encouraged to talk about things and have opinion about things that they don't know anything about. Basically, they're pushing, they're being pushed to bullshit. So politicians who are expected to know about everything, have opinions about everything, or citizens in some democratic societies who are expected to have, to have opinions about everything, they are encouraged to become bullshit artists, which is very unfortunate consequence of these kinds of discourses. I am uh, a little bit critical about Frankfurt's distinction between lying and bullshitting. I think the boundary is not that clear cut, but I still believe the book is extremely important because of the way he takes us on a tour on uh, things involving in human expressions, telling truth and telling lying, and what is unique features of bullshitting, how bullshitting is different from lying. So, so it's a unqualified book recommendation and I hope you enjoyed. If you have other thoughts, uh, feel free to let me know. Thank you.